David Tell, what's Dave. up, buddy? Hey, guys. Thanks Dave. for having me in. Thank you for fucking wanting to do our show. Wow. All right. You know? Yeah. I missed I the whole Cal Burnett thing. Uh, I didn't know you guys were, you know. Huge fans of Cal Burnett. We love her. Is that Huge. what you call it? Yeah. Okay. Is that what you call it? <laughs> yes. Yeah, no, she's great. Uh, I was just... Harvey Corman. what do you think? Well, he's, not, he's, he's been quiet as of late. Yeah, I know. But, I mean, I always felt like he was... He, I think he was one of the people who, uh, he was like a serious actor or something like that. He was always like putting down Tim Conway and, and all the rest of them. Yeah. He always was threatening to walk off. Yeah, he was very difficult, Harvey, they said. Mm -hmm. And uh, they, they, well, they, the three of them, uh, Carol Burnett, Vicki Lawrence, and Tim Conway were here not too long ago. Oh. And they did a QA and a and they talked about Harvey being difficult mm -hmm. and threatening to walk off. He was for real difficult? Oh, yeah. But I mean, whatever it worked out. Huh. Where... Tim Conway was hilarious. But he wasn't there in the beginning. Tim, a lot of these guys came along later. Mm. She was on. He was like the Bill Murray of uh, they brought yeah, him in yeah, when yeah. they were a hit. You a know? little later mm -hmm. <laughs> for the second season. Yeah, I missed mm. all the good chat. Yeah, North Korea. Were you guys talking about that? Uh, yeah, yes. not really. Kim Jong Un. A little bit. Yeah. What's your take on that whole thing? I don't know. I kind of. I know it's not. Probably the cool take, but I kind of see his side. I mean, <laughs> I was a fat kid growing up with a girl's first name, and <laughs> he's the fat. He definitely is the fattest guy in the country. I mean, yeah. Yeah. no kidding. I mean, that's got to be hard, you know. You can't have a fat leader when you're starving. Yeah, your yeah your people just, are starving. How does he feel about it? So with that lesbian haircut, yeah. <laughs> he looks goofy doing everything too. Yeah. And they're trying to make him a tough guy. You know, showing him shooting, and they shoot off a missile, and they show him with the binoculars. Looking at it, right, right. and he just looks like the goofy little yeah. fat kid. Yeah, like like someone brought their kid to work. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know how we do, which yeah. is someone's name over there. <laughs> I'm looking for a, looking for a way to say that. <laughs> Sorry. All right, that was hacky. No one wanted so, to you don't think so? No, no. a little bit. Uh, it's just eh, fuck the missiles fly. That's what I say. <laughs> Yeah. That's gotta suck if you live in Guam, which is like the Puerto Rico of the Pacific. <laughs> have you ever, <laughs> you ever pulled an R and R in Guam? Anybody here? I'm sure, your dad has a story or two about good old Guam. Guam. No, no, he spent the entire Vietnam War in Canada. <laughs> <laughs> my brother lived in Guam for a while. See, my right. marine biologist brother. He loved it. Did it capsize? Uh, didn't capsize like no. you. You've, you've heard that clip, right, David Tell? The no. famous clip. Oh, uh, we gotta play it for David Tell. Clip. What is it? We have to play this for David Tell. I, I don't even a, want to tell you what it yes, is. It's, it's a real clip. Let's see it. Of a, I guess, a congressional hearing or whatever. Yes, no. this, this is always um, fun. This is one of the best <laughs> clips. <laughs> this is always. Fun. They're talking about Guam. This one is fun. He talked to a general about Guam and and building on one side of the island or the other. <laughs> All right. Oh well. Fuck. Come on. Hank. Okay. I have the better not be goofy music over this. No. <laughs> yeah, listen, Sam, stop listen to this guy. Come on, Sam. And he's dead. He's talking to a general or something, Serious. or an admiral. Yes. Yeah. Hank Johnson. Hank Johnson. Thank you. Dumb cunt. Widest level is what? No, gotta go, back more. gotta go back. Who's that guy? Number 43? Is there a better version? Yeah, of this? get, get this fucking. I know, Sam, version. you're wrecking everything. They're putting subtitles in. Stop spurling it. We Look, just... This is a uh, yeah, yeah. island that edits. Widest level is what 12 miles from shore to shore, and at its smallest level, uh, or smallest uh, mm -hmm. uh, location, it's uh, <laughs> seven <laughs> miles uh, uh, between one shore and the other. It's a congressman, is that is correct? It? Yeah, uh, I don't have the exact uh, dimensions, but uh, to your point, like sir, I think a real Guam person. is a small island, very a small person. island, and about 24 miles, if I recall, long. <laughs> so, 20, 24 miles long, about seven miles wide at the least widest uh, <laughs> place on the island, and about 20. About 12 miles wide uh, uh, on the widest part of the island, and um, wow! Oh my God! I don't what? know how many square miles that. Wait that for is. the punchline. Do you happen to this. know? I don't have that 
uh, figure with me, sir. I can certainly supply it to you if you'd like. Yeah, my, my fear is that, pause. that the, uh, the general should have said, well, will you get to your fucking yeah, points? What's your we get fucking it. You're trying point. to say this island's a little small. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a it's, small, long, thin island. But right. this, this admiral or general is just dealing with a congressman the way that these dummies are dealt with. Yes. Mm -hmm. Being polite to him. Right. <laughs> you know. There's but, no reason to be polite to this guy. What He's, a dumb motherfucker Hank Johnson is. You're about to hear what state is he from? I don't Sorry. know, but you're about to hear one of the stupidest men alive. Oh yeah, yeah. This is this is brilliant. this is just a setup. Dave. Hold on to your hats, kids. Here it comes. The setup is extremely long. I yeah. know, but here it it's comes. It's worth it. The payoff is worth it. Do you, if you'd like? Yeah, my my fear is that uh, the whole island will uh, become so overly populated that it will tip over and uh, and capsize. Uh, we don't anticipate that. The, uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> but he's got to answer like it's a little shitting me. That's a congressman. Did they ask him what he meant by that? I mean, but they all he... just no. Believe me, they were all thinking one thing. <laughs> <laughs> he thinks you build too much shit on there, it's going to get heavy, and the fucking thing's going to capsize. Because there, islands are just floating around in the ocean. He's a congressman. I kind of see Hank Johnson's point. <laughs> Do you? Yeah. Keep going. No, I think, uh, you know, it sucks because the Admiral, he's he has to kind of, you know, I guess they can, can they get fired, Georgia. like, by the congressional people? I mean. No, they got to be fucking oh. voted out unless they're okay. they're deemed incompetent. But I think the, the, the whole procedure. To do oh, that is impossible. He's still in the House of Representatives. Oh, oh my God! The incumbent, and uh, he came into office 2007, preceded by, of course, Cynthia McKinney. That fucking twat. oh, that fucking dumb what piece of shit. What a shit district this is. Wow. And, and uh, this dummy followed Cynthia McKinney, and he's still in. Who is really a fucking a horrible? You woman. know why? Because his constituency will vote in based on nothing but the color of someone's skin. But if you think period. an island could fuck, because he's black. Well, no one white's running. For if that you one. think an island. Can sink. Someone's got to fucking say, "Look, why we, everyone we, voting for him probably thinks the same fucking oh thing." Oh my god! All right, let me, dunces. So how does it end up? I mean, like, what you got to hear. Yeah. Well, ironically enough, the island actually did tip over. <laughs> yes. So, and then the, the, so, uh, ha -ha. the general had to apologize for screaming the end bomb all the way out. <laughs> Guam population, I think, currently about 175,000, and again, with 8,000 Marines and their families, it's an addition of about 25,000 uh, more uh, into the population. And, uh, and also, uh, things like the uh, environment. Uh, He's definitely the in over his head. Yeah. 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 Wow. Yeah. This is the guy making decisions. Yeah. It's, it's yes. infuriating. Why is this fucking dumb motherfucker like a, making decisions? Everyone yeah. went to lunch or something, and he's just kind of like, you know, you just ask a couple of questions, we'll be back. Yeah, yeah, we'll be right back. <laughs> right. Right. Sound like we had Hold it. down the fort, don't talk. <laughs> and then he decides to, you know, talk. Wow. The two areas of uh, the environment, coral reefs and those kinds of things, and I know that you know, lots of people don't like to think about that, but, you know, we didn't think about global warming either. And um, yeah, global warming. now we do have to think about it. And do so uh, I'm concerned from an environmental standpoint whether or not Guam is the, the, the best place to do this relocation, but it's actually the only place. Is that correct? Uh, this is the best place. This is the farthest west U.S. territory that we own. And, uh, you know, I, this is part of our nation. Yeah. Uh, and in readdressing the forward presence and posture importance uh, to Pacific this Command, guy uh, Guam has is to actually uh, address to the this city decision. Of this guy has to address him. This idiot. Look, the other guy was laughing. Yeah. Of course they were laughing. <laughs> how? That's great. How does he run for office and get reelected unless the voting pe public are fucking morons? He had that great preacher voice, you know, yeah. like kind of, ah, uh, oh. you know, uh, comforting. It was good. What if somebody straps a motor on Guam? <laughs> and drives it away in the night, and you wake up and you ain't there no more. <laughs> well, sir, it's very hard to propel a large island through the uh, ocean, sir, uh, to a completely different location, sir. Okay, what happens if someone's digging a hole for like a building, and the islands spring a leak and sink? 
<laughs> yeah, sir, that can't happen either. Uh, <laughs> see, the island is actually um, connected to the earth. It's it's a, virtually a mountain where most of it is under the water, and just the top is poking out. No, you sound ridiculous. A, a mountain in the ocean? That's crazy. There's self-control on the guy. Uh, right? You would have to yell at him. Holy mother of fuck. The self-control. And takes. how far away is that guy from being president? Like if there was some kind of <laughs> asteroid hit or something. Way closer than yeah. us. <laughs> yeah. Yes, closer than us. That's all we have to know. I know one thing. I'm way smarter than that fuck. I know. Fuck. Global warming. That's not true. No. You see, that, that was a about fallacy. He was trying to go for the thing like, you know. Yeah. I'll go Which, for the liberal uh, thing here. Global warming. We didn't think we have to think about that, and now we got to think about the global warming. <laughs> you know, UFOs and the Loch Ness Monster. We didn't think, but now we got to deal with that. The Tooth Fairy. <laughs> that is dummy. Uh, I'm amazed he's still in office. I'm amazed he's uh, not working at the comedy cellar. <laughs> I mean, really, he's going to fit right in. Uh, uh, shit. He's got a good style. Oh, uh, he Likeable. does. Good delivery. Mm, I like that. Guy. Yeah. Well, Hank. What else is on Hank your radar Johnson. there, David Tell? Well, uh, I guess uh, for the fans of Dave's Old Porn, uh, there's no new season. What? And, uh, what? It's kind of sad. Uh, the network said that it wasn't about ratings. It wasn't about content. It was uh, about programming. Mm. They're going to run all the uh, first season one and two over and over for the next two years or so. <laughs> two years. <laughs> what Wait, what do they mean it's about programming? They didn't have room for it? No, no. Uh, they they figure it's kind of like one of those shows where, like, you know, it's evergreen. They can, they oh, can, boy. Uh, uh, and I'm doing a Hank Johnson here. Well, uh, well. no. Uh, so it was like, uh, you know, one of those things where they. That's what they told me. I don't know if it's true or not, but uh, ratings wise, it was good, and we got a lot of great feedback from the people. Dave, you know. if I could ask you a question, Dave, <laughs> I was watching your show. It caps us. How do you fit inside the television? <laughs> Because I see you're a larger man than you look when I watch you on the show. <laughs> um, <laughs> sir. Hank Johnson's adult. Sir. Yeah. That um, makes you happy too, right? <laughs> oh, it makes me it makes ecstatic. Me very happy. I'm glad the Admiral didn't show up with his saucy parrot. He would have had <laughs> unkind words. <laughs> oh, no, no new season of Dave's Old Porn. That yeah, that does blows. suck. And you know what I'm trying to do? So I have so much, so many great clips, you know, that we haven't mm. shown. And and like, uh, like today, we're putting up another episode of the uh, My First Porn Stories, which Jim did one. It's his episode. His clip today oh, is on the Dave's Old Porn dot com. Oh, what's cool. the uh, what's the well, gist of that? What do you do? Well, I just asked everybody about their first like time they ever saw porn. Oh, that's you know? fucking cool. It's not a it's not a particularly new idea, but it, it, everybody has some. You know, it's really interesting. All comics we all have like a sad first porn story. <clears throat> yeah. And everybody like Jim's was pretty incredibly weird and good, but weird. You know, I don't remember. I mean, was it the was it with the mutton chops when I saw the porn picture? How long was the clip? Could we play no, here? It was. Um, huh? Can we play? Yeah, it? you can play it. Go ahead. Do you mind? No, I love it. All right. Nice. Mm. Here's Jim talking about his first time watching. And Dave. Porn. And Dave, of course. Guys, yes. I just interjected nothing. <laughs> the first porn I ever saw was at my friend Raja. He's an Indian kid. Mm -hmm. And his father had oh, one of those shit. top load VCRs. And we watched The Fur Trap with Kelly Mint and Herschel. It was an awful movie. Uh -huh. But there was a lesbian seduction scene where she's like, oh, I don't know if we should be doing this. It, it, it affected me so much. I, I actually just went into his parents' bathroom and I lay on the floor and I jerked off with my head on the floor by his father's toilet. Wow. That's my first porn experience. That is so similar to my first drinking experience. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> <clears throat> it was no congressional hearing, but uh, Jimmy yeah. brought it. It was a great story. Well, that, well, that's Johnson. the movie. Yeah, I always think about the, the first Very porn good. picture that I ever saw had mutton chops in them. But yeah, I remember that. I still remember that movie. I remember the smell of his parents' bedroom. It wasn't really? a bad smell. Wow. It was just it. that moment changed my life. Like, I remember being so smitten with lust at this these the seduction mm. of this woman seducing the other one going like, wow. I, I don't know if we yeah. we are actually seeing a cock be sucked by a girl like you it you, blows your mind you would only really imagine that or seen one in your own face <laughs> <laughs> to see a girl doing that it was i was i could not Wrap my head around how amazing this was, and I had yeah. to go jerk off on his parents' fucking bathroom floor. Wow. And then, do you remember the next time? It probably was years later. The next time you saw porn. I, next thing I know, I came out of a blackout, and I was thirty-five. <laughs> <laughs>
I had, I had intimacy I had issues. Morgan, the kid. <laughs> yeah, I came out of a blackout with fucking a bunch of destroyed relationships <laughs> and a path of human wreckage behind me. <laughs> We had found a, uh, a, a Super 8 millimeter film and didn't have a projector to, to watch it on. And it was an old, you know, stag film and uh, <laughs> had to go to my high school and try to talk the AV guy into lending us a projector oh, wow. to take to my buddy's house. It was like a block away from the high school. And uh, we did that, loaded it up and he said, and actually yes. saw, yeah, wow. and actually saw a moving fucking porn yeah you know, you'd seen magazines and shit like that but like you said when you when it's moving pictures yeah. porn for the first time it, it fucking it, it all kinds of glands inside you start shooting fluid that never came yeah. out and before you didn't realize what your it's, body was capable oh, it's of crazy and you're always with another dude, usually, for the first time, video. But yeah. magazines is like the first, you know, alone in your own world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you find, mm. Sam, can you look up well. The First Trap but with Kelly Mint? And I think... Uh, we got to find the scene that... Was Jamie Gillis in set that? Set you on your way. Or no, it wasn't. It might have been... Uh, he's. Mm. I think he's doing stand-up now. Who's the porn guy doing stand-up? Herschel Savage. I think Herschel Savage. Herschel was just in a um, theatrical uh, stage play of uh, Deep Throat. Um, something like that. <laughs> really? <Yeah. laughs> With Hank Johnson? Yes. I remember being at my friend Frank's house. and uh, Oh, Frank was better? Oh, Frank was better. <laughs> and it was a bunch of guys hanging out, and he had a VCR downstairs in his, like, his man room. Like, his guy, you know, we were 15 years old or whatever, and he had all these, uh, you know, weights and shit. We'd all hang out there, hit the heavy bag. And uh, they were all going to swim upstairs in Frank's pool, and I remember watching this Swedish erotica porn. And Ron Jeremy's in the scene. Ooh. And these two girls suck his dick. And the one girl, it's like home video, and the one girl has braces and her fucking juicy lips suck in his cock. And then the scene before it, again, I was so... Braces of, on her legs? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. She had polio. Was she, okay, it's really weird. And she <laughs> fell out of her chair, and he fucked her face while the mm. family banged on the door. Mm. There was a... Uh, I wonder what happened to Raja. <laughs> I talked to him the other day. He's in a mm. Kiss cover band. He's a buddy of mine. Oh, really? He's oh. still a friend of mine. Yeah, he's a guy I like Wow. Around. Oh, he's a Gene Simmons fanatic. Oh, I, I saw Gene at the roast, and I promised him that I would. Sh I promised Raj I would show <clears throat> Gene a picture of Raj in his makeup. And I just—he's one of my oldest friends. Uh oh. So I'm fucking following Gene, and he said hi to me, but he was walking quick because people were mobbing him, and he was being nice to me. Uh -huh. But I showed him the fucking the picture. And That's he's, great. I'm gonna charge him uh, <laughs> uh, fees to actually do the music. <laughs> fucking cocksucker. Did you find it? No, he was nice. Oh, my oh. God, Sam. Oh, that is good. Oh, is this I've the seen this film, yeah. Wow. This is a loop. That looks like a young Sandy Kane. <clears throat> Wait, is this Ew, it does. It does, right? Yeah, she's killing a dinosaur. <laughs> she's old. Wow, oh that's a nice God. bush. Oh, no, that's a <laughs> massive wow. bush. That's great. I swear to God, I thought she had panties on. I thought, panties panties on. On. I thought I that was that. It's Look like up all the, the way Black to the Angus hips. Steakhouse. Pause. 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 Is, is, it, is it even possible for a girl to grow like that? I, I don't yeah. think it is. I think genetically, women have changed where they can't even grow a bush Not that big that anymore. Not to that point. There's no way. It goes all the way to the hip bones. How could she wear pants? I mean, right. it's, yeah. it's, like, yeah. it's like a choice. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I tell you, what, that's what it was like when I was young. Oh, yeah, Joe. Oh, you get in there, you park it to drive it. Oh, what the heck? You guys talk dirty. What do I need? <laughs> you get me a container of coffee, I'm happy. I don't watch this gunk. <laughs> Dave, you like a hairy bush or what? <laughs> Not that hairy. I mean, that's, that's, that's a little rough, yeah, right? That's, wow, that's too much. <laughs> Is that too much? That's That's definitely like, you know... Woodstock, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. They used to call it the 70s uh, Earth Mama. Earth yeah. Mama. Maybe now my dad will, you know, understand. You know. It, was part of, it was part of growing up, though, having to do that, that little fucking it. thing with your fingers like... Uh. Like fucking Artie Johnson and laughing. Very intense. <laughs> That's for the older demo. I know. Yeah. Yeah. They're out there. They're yeah. appreciating oh, it. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. the scene I'm thinking of is they were wearing fur coats because they worked at like a factory of fur coats. Well, that was the first wearing fur panties. Yeah. I want to see more of this huge. I want to see more the of this fuck huge. Fucking Tyson Perry. Push play. Push play. Push back, but that's, that's, that's like, wow. Yeah, that's too much. It would be it would be cool if like she never shaved since like ever right like and imagine how it is now like beyond ZZ Top through the Al Jazeera that is like, that, but that's a situation where you just don't shave at all yeah that, that's, that's been growing for years that's a choice let's push play I want to see what fucking happens in this scene just her standing up with the, where it looks like she has black okay. panties on she's squeezing her own breast oh no yeah. she looks alarmed uh oh. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. <laughs> Look at that push. 
It's that's just half bush and it's stole. Is, yeah, and it's yeah. also going down the leg. It goes right up her asshole to the back of her head. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's terrible. It ends on Ron Jeremy's back. <laughs> <laughs> Two movies over. Oh, look wow. at her. She's hot though, man. Look yeah, at her. Yeah, she's a nice she's fucking. She's so dirty. She looks Heavy so fucking tits. very dirty girl. Good music. I love the music, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Who is this actress? Because I she doesn't ring a bell to me. Oh, I see. I don't know. Harry Cunt McGillicuddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. This is I like, don't know. Why we got like, long nipples? Aren't they great? Those areolas. This I would like, suckle yeah. them. This sounds like driving music from Canon. Yeah. <laughs> like, he's, yes. he's driving through fucking Studio City. Yeah. This is great. It looks like she has one leg with just like whatever that is, a roadkill in her lap. Like she's going <laughs> to do some taxidermy. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, what happened there? I don't know. Oh, oh, little, oh man. Cut. She's standing right. up. Yes. Ooh. Oh, wow. She has a Russian hat in her lap. She is hot. <laughs> that's, that's fucking... I love that look. Look at that. Yeah, but her pussy. Oh, my God. Wow. She has a hairy wow. pussy. Look how high up that pussy hair goes. Yeah. Wow. Jesus, it's a mohawk. Is this is, is not the fur trap. So crazy. Huh? It's not the fur trap? No. Zip through, through Sam. You're going too slow. Dude, Zip this through is it. craziness, that bush. It's terrible. Yeah, we'll no, be hoping we can find the actual through. part of the scene where you, uh, you know. This is not it. It's not even the movie. This girl. This is the girl from. This is the tub lady from The Shining. Oh, good. She's doing, oh, good. She's doing a dancing. groovy dance. She's doing a pussy it's dance. It's cool. Yeah. She looks like the sniper from Full Metal Jacket. <laughs> yeah. It's funny. Shit. Oh, let's go. Oh, oh, good music. Good music. Wait, let's see what their bushes They're look like. They're really hot too. Look yeah. at that one. Come yeah. On. Show that cunt. <laughs> look how big their panties are. <laughs> They're giant oh, panties. God. Mm. Yeah. Just feeling yeah. her. Yeah. yeah. An exploratory really kiss. It's such uh -oh. slow motion. Here we go. Fucking. What yeah. year is this again? Touching. <laughs> look at those giant panties. Oh, look at panties. Wow. Oh, those are great She's panties. She's wearing diapers. <laughs> they went. Look at those incontinent women. Uh oh. There is nothing. Sexy about those panties. This is a porn called Women with Bladder Cancer. They <laughs> <laughs> have giant diapers on. <laughs> oh. oh, what's going this on? Is crazy. They look so stoned, too, don't yeah, they? They probably are. They're like, really? It's like the orgy scene from Faces of Death. <laughs> it's really sexy. My favorite part so far is the couch behind them. Yeah, that is a good one. Yeah. It's going to be on Scorch's set next week. <laughs> <laughs> All spotted. <laughs> Fucking couch has rosacea. <laughs> you want to oh. fast forward a little? Hey, come on, uh, Sam. You're picking the worst part. To, um, I just want to see what they look like yeah, without yeah, these yeah, giant yeah. panties yeah. on. Yeah, I want to see yeah. these chicks. Big Let's bushes. see those hairy cunts. <laughs> yeah, Chip. That broad's still dancing. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh look at that. Oh, look at that. Ass she's Squeezing those ass cheeks nicely. It's a lot. Oh, this is great. A lot of darkness in there. Okay. I love this. Girl standing up. Wow. And clumsy movements. You know that girl's dancing like the old man in Cuckoo's Nest? When Nicholson's trying to get him to vote? Put your hand up. You want to watch the ball game with your hairy cunt? <laughs> this is quite a night at the junior college. Oh, they're going to do go. some scissoring. Look at the bush on that. No, they're oh. like hiding from that bush. Like yeah. a tornado. Yes. They're just dry humping sloppily. This chick is doing like an acid dance. Yeah. She's is terrible. this that show Girls? <laughs> What's going on here? She's, no, she's dancing like that girl on Midnight Cowboy. Remember that crazy girl in the diner who was like putting the fucking kids toy in her face? No? No, I'm not recalling that scene. All right. I uh, find the first trap. This is fucking not what I wanted. No. Sam. It sucks when one girl's on coke and the other two girls are on lyrics. Damn. It really does. Damn. They didn't party Damn. right. That sounds. That riff sounds like another song. Don't go to X Hamster. Go to Google. Google. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Google. Hocus Pocus by Focus. I think that's what that riff sounded like. Bam. That was bam, some hot stuff. Bam. Man. Bam. Very good. But anyway, yeah. Jim, thanks for volunteering your porn story. That was good. Oh, of course, man. Yeah. I enjoyed doing that show. I was I was much fatter. I wish it was still going because I'd love to have the th new thin neck yeah, going you've, on. You've yeah. gunned up a bit. Well, you know. Hey, yeah. it's summer, right? <laughs> summer is fucking. Jim was at Caroline's this weekend too. Oh, Cozy really? Time. Oh, just hitting home runs. We got to push the Sunday show. <laughs> Sunday show. Sunday show. Yeah, weekend. It's got to be sold out by now, no? Friday, Saturday is, uh, but the Sunday probably has tickets. Oh, great. Go, that's birthday. the one I'm going to. Oh. Is it Hitler's birthday? Uh, that's next week. Four twenty, right? <laughs> yeah. Yep. 
420. Hitler's birthday. Mm-mm-mm. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. <laughs> to you. But it's when Kim, Kim, what's his name again? Kim, Kim, uh, Jong-un. Kim Jong-un. The, the great grandpa, whatever his name was. Uh, yes. Whoever. It's his birthday. That's when they're supposedly going to. Uh, and he turns launch. 100 if mm-hmm. he was still alive. It's his wow. 100th birthday. So it's a big, Everything's going on. It's a that's big day crazy. for all, all the fucking mm. tyrants uh, emerging. But I also think the Wasn't anniversary. Wasn't it the first. Uh, the first rush hour is coming out. That might be a big deal. Oh, that too. could do that it movie. too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm in a crazy move myself. I'm uh, going out to Jersey this weekend, hitting the stress factory. Braggard. I'm a little excited. I don't know about you guys. Oh, stress yeah. factory? Yeah. This weekend? Yeah. Nice. David Tell. You know, I'm going to get a pork roll. Um, is course, it uh, called the Stress Factory? Yeah, it's, it's called in, uh, Brand Brand Stress Factory. Or is it called right. New Brunswick? Vinny New Brunswick. Brands. Yeah, I'm going to throw Factory. a ball at a player yeah. and call him up. <laughs> he, put, he, he put his name on the building there, David wow. Tell. This is the last time you were there. Vinny's yep. is great. It's Vinny Brand's Stress Factory. Yes. No, sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, how many, how many uh, comedy shows have you guys been talked into going to? Because every like one of Norton's shows, I could see you guys like the casino shows, I could see. Oh, yeah. But then there's got to be all those other shows that you're like, oh, all right, I guess I'll have to go. Wow. I'll go to I like uh, I like when Jimmy's at Caroline's. That's a nice, easy. easy fucking. I stay That's in the city. One. I'm like a couple of blocks away from the place anyway. It's great. Here it is. Do you remember the first time we played at Caroline's? That'll be my next uh, project. <clears throat> I can kind of remember. Uh, <laughs> you know, I said to myself, "You're on Broadway." Ah, <laughs> the crossroads of the world. Yeah, it's great because once you get one joke about like uh, Jersey Boys, you can use it every time you work. There. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. or, you know, I'm opening up with Miss, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm opening up with. Uh, hey, remember Cats used to be at the Winter Garden Theater? They said now and forever. Apparently not. Ah, <laughs> fucking kills every time. Time, right? <laughs> and then someone from the back goes, Mama Mia's there now. And then what would you say? Oh, Mama Mia's there now. Oh, yeah? I hear she's very ill. I hear she's having a problem with her ovaries. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> My mother has cancer. <laughs> Your mother is one. <laughs> so Caroline's a class club. It's great. It really Top is. Of and really that is. goddamn Greg Charles. Yeah. Greg Holy is a good shit. man. I go in there. Uh, I fucking. Uh, I don't. I don't pay for anything. He hooks us up. It's amazing. I take what I would have paid uh, for for my drinks and everything, and I give it to the fucking waiter or waitress, and I say, "Keep coming back." And boy, do they ever! It's my little gimmick to keep drinking <laughs> <laughs> at an alarming rate. <laughs> Wait a second. I got a joke before we go. What's red? In the- Wait. <laughs> Wait. Hold on. It's fucking like what? Sorry. Black and white and red all over. What? Fucking newspaper. <laughs> hey, that was- the Opie and Anthony show will return in a moment. After all, you guys have to piss too. And now back to the Opie and Anthony show. Da, 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 da. David Tell in studio playing the Stress Factory oh, this weekend yeah, in New really Brunswick, wild. New Jersey. That helped. Uh, People are and then you got uh, Jim Norton at Caroline's uh, sold out show Sunday. Oh, yeah. You can uh, go tonight, Sunday still. 212-757-4100. Yeah. I mean, there might be uh, tickets on the late show tonight. I'm not sure. Uh, I know the early show and both shows Saturday sold out. That's go great, see Jimmy. Jimmy. He's yeah. a fucking he is pisser. Great. Oh, really but Dave's sitting right there. No, I, I tip over Jim. Oh no, uh, we guys. <laughs> right Our last the gig together in Vegas. That was it. That was, that a was fun, one. man. You really guys nice together one. is yeah. a fucking great combination. By it the really way, it really was good. We should do more of them. Loved the Brigada yeah. show this year. Loved it. Yeah, that was a good one. Huh? Mm-hmm. We'll do more. The you fun. know what's great? It's like every time you play the Brigada, you see the same security people. Yeah, and like we're all kind of like in that. That you know, they sit on their chair. We all look at each other. Mm. You know, it's kind of sad. Yeah. yeah. You know. <laughs> but we all. I, I love the Borgata. I do too. It's my my fucking place. Well. Yeah. I don't know what to say. I'm a high I would, roller. I would go see Jim if I wasn't uh, working myself tonight. Do both. Yeah. Have, I, I guess think the right. people could. Do yeah, yeah, you go to the Stretch Factory, then you zip on back for the late show. No, you know the mass what? transit. I think the last train out of a uh, New Brunswick. Fuck the train. Uh, you fucking drink uh, like a motherfucker. Eleven forty-seven. What? You drink like a motherfucker seeing you, and then you hop in your car, you fucking drive into the city. I'm listening. Go ahead. <laughs> it's one of the last times I, I fucking drove drunk. 
uh, it was we, 4th of July. We had just gotten off of uh, this Billy This is, by the way, something Anthony said on July 5th. <laughs> 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 we got off, off a Billy Max boat, fucking hammered. How many years ago? This is fucking probably it's been probably a while, right? Maybe seven years ago, something like that. Wow. We got off of a Billy Max boat. We're fucking hammered, and someone had the bright idea of saying, "Let's go into the city to a bar and play some foosball," <laughs> and, and and we 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 really raced each other into the city, driving like maniacs, drunk off our asses into Manhattan on the 4th of July. How I didn't get fucking pulled over. That was seven years ago? Yeah, wow. is beyond me. Mm. It was bad. I don't even remember who the fuck was with me. Was it uh, maybe um, oh. the old crew? Danny Ross? Fucking Than? I think yeah. Nathaniel? Um, I remember... I think that I went the year after when we had limos. Oh, that's why the limos were... Yes, yes. Yeah. And, and then we, we got limos into the equation. That. Yeah. I, I was petrified the next day when I got home and... Uh, Want to look at your car? I looked at the car parked in the driveway sideways and shit. Was it sideways a little bit? It was, yeah, it a was bit. a little sideways. And uh, I don't know how I ever, ever fucking did that. It's crazy. But how was the boat part of it? Because that's... Great. That's I mean. <laughs> oh, the when fireworks. When I was drinking, I never boated it up like that. The fuck, it was, uh, we used to go out all the time, right out of um, the marina, Flushing yep. Marina, go by uh, down the river, uh... Billy Mac, you know, law, law enforcement. So oh, we'd shit. get a spot right there on the river by the fucking fireworks. And uh, it was great. Just drinking on a party boat, fireworks, fucking crazy. It was great. I love boating. Back in the, uh, what I call, the day. The day. I now can't... I just party at my house. It's easier that way. Yeah. Fuck we should get a boat. Get a boat. <laughs> what? Get a boat. crowded in here. Boats are the worst fucking thing you can get. Fuck that. Even look, look at Louis C.K. He has a boat now? Oh, he's... Oh. He went, got a boat, yeah. grounded it, and was stranded for a little while. Yeah. And that experience made him decide to get a bigger boat. He's the captain of the Edmund Fitzgerald. <laughs> 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 yeah, now he just bought a bigger boat. It's, the money that... You have to throw into boats is ridiculous. Speaking of Louis C.K., really quickly, uh, HBO gave us five hundred dollars to give away. Yes, they did. Louis C.K. has that big special tomorrow yes. night at ten o'clock on HBO called "Oh My God." Yeah, uh, Matt from Joplin, Missouri, won the five hundred dollars. Excellent, Joplin. He heard the "Mooey, Mooey, Mooey, Mooey" thing. I'm I bet that's going to be great. That special. Mm -hmm. It's going to be it's amazing. Good, yeah. The reviews are are great. Yeah, and actually, a, a few people around here have seen it and said it's unbelievable. See? So. Louis is the man. He is. He's on top. Of Jimmy. Uh, Jimmy wants you to feed him the grapes. Would you? Would you do that? Yeah, because you pop one in your asshole and then squat over my face, mm. and I'll poke your stomach until it plinks into my mouth. <laughs> That's a hell. Of a I way was to kidding. Eat grapes. Yeah. He actually touched my grapes. No, thank you. So, Jim, is that the secret to your weight loss? There, these. Uh, uh, it's the grape diet. Yes, I love it. You can eat that whole plate of grapes. I certainly am. Wow. No, I. I uh, Selfish you know, Dave. It's just. Uh, <laughs> it's a lot of exercise. And oh, that's right. Helped. It was also Big Kev mm -hmm. was on that drunk trip, and Rick Shapiro was with us. No way! Yes, that was. Um, I think Ricky's getting married. By the way, it's Melinda. Yeah. Melinda checking in with that because she was there. Holy yes, he's shit. marrying Tracy. I, I can't go though because I'm working. Hi, Mini Men. They're finally getting married. Yeah, they've been together for a while, huh? Since Tony and Tina's and Tony's wedding. Uh. <laughs> oh, a nice yogurt and a big plate of grapes. Mm. You know me, dude. That explain that shitty fucking smell, that fart. You're, 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 yeah, uh, well, there's a price to pay for everything, but it's like I say, healthy eating, healthy living. <laughs> <laughs> I say that a lot. No, you shouldn't. <laughs> you're, you're, just you're fucking. Stinky, smelly fart. It's 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 beyond like farting. It's, it's so like, bad, it's like, right? It smells like corruption. That's <laughs> <laughs> true. I call this Serpico. <laughs> There's nothing fun about it. It's like <laughs> yeah. if you get like a, a and everyone goes ha ha ha. But Jimmy's is it's it's uh, tragic. Yeah, like decay. Yes, yeah. yes. Like a, a school, like a train going through Brooklyn with a lot of graffiti on it. <laughs> Like that's that's your shitty <laughs> the old smart. school like the fucking yeah. beginning shot of welcome back yeah Connor. that's what I was thinking yeah yes. <laughs> yeah like New York like old gritty old New York odd couple uh, era yeah really got some crazy smell yeah. to it you know are those lightable I mean uh, probably not uh, I don't know I never wanted to light them though mm. man you're missing his new character David Tell.
Oh, oh I'm sorry. He's setting right. up his new character, Grape, and you're I not forgot. asking him. I forgot the new character. Grape Cheeks. What's this guy's name? Grape Cheeks. <laughs> he talks with Grape Cheeks. <laughs> yes, it's Grape Grape Cheeks. He's very creative when it comes to naming his characters. What's that guy's name? He's got grapes in his cheeks. Grape Cheeks. Yeah. I'm good. All right. Do you Look eat all I those fucking grapes? I see a, you go for the ones uh, up front. They have a lot of good uh, nutrients in them. I like yeah. a juicy, healthy grape. <laughs> mm. I like them a few days old when they're like yeah. in between grape and raisin. Oh, yeah. You know, I like that. <laughs> it's like, ah, I don't know if I should wait or just throw them out. Good for <laughs> cancer fighting. Yeah. yeah. I'll go with my chain smoking. <laughs> a couple of grapes. Yeah. Stick with what works. <laughs> have you tried to quit? I'm not gonna. I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to quit for another couple of months. Why? Because I'm like trying to do a DVD for that show, mm -hmm. the porn show, and then I want to start, uh, you know, doing some other, uh, you know, stand up stuff. I want to get back to the stand up, and then, uh, you know, other than that, I'm kind of broke. So like, I'm stressed out, you know. And like, as you know, ghetto people, we need our, our we need our pleasures where we can get them, whether it's Your simple uh, little yeah, vices, how the fuck like, jug they... wine or uh, cigarettes or. You know? how, how the fuck are you broke? Well, you know, I'm white man broke. I mean, I still have a boat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, <yeah. laughs> not, not as big as a boat, but a little. A little yeah. I have a, well, uh, I have a landing craft. That explains well, everything. Craft on. <laughs> Why does smoking have to be your pleasure? Why can't it be, you know, handball? Waving at a small child, or perhaps <laughs> handing a flower to an older person. Oh. Is this great <laughs> piece, or who is this guy? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a delightful day. <laughs> you know, they've been the fun pleasures. They've been showing that uh, baseball. Brawl all day. The pitcher broke yes. his collarbone. That's gonna oh, be the worst. Right, then. Fuck. What is that? Like a half a billion dollar wound? I mean, he's the pitcher. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Man, that is true. Yeah. You're... And the other guy was coming out, but he dropped the bat. So he, he, was, he was like, "All right." I don't Fucking to to broke his collarbone. I bet wow. if you don't drop that bat. You get in a lot of yeah, fucking trouble. I would assume so. Out. Yeah, you're that's a, a fucking. That's an arrest. Yeah. yeah. But that was the third time he beamed him. Oh, oh, look at that. There that it is. That is. There and he thinks about it. And he's like, oh, guy, yeah. They like how he throws himself into the game. They just don't want him to throw himself into the game the way they need it here. And certainly, this is the only way to it just had to it's not only involved Granky, but it got so bad and things were so heated that this actually continued in the players' parking lot as the game after the game after nice. this was all over. Did Matt Kemp confronted a Padres yeah. player outside of the stadium. So there's a lot of things going on here, a lot of moving parts. But the part that everybody's left over with in the morning is that Granky is now out for quite some time, and that is a blow for LA for sure. Uh, that Granky, uh, why does it cheer up? So let's switch. Wow, they were so fighting in the parking lot. Tucker That's old school. Nice. Same opening yeah. score. He won with three times. Pretty good. Yeah, absolutely. He uh, he's a good you habit. You're so. golf people, right? Not really. I, I am. We're but white. These guys are really. <laughs> Yeah, they don't really follow. Because one guy got a hole in one. They should have just like Sorry. right after that. It should either be hole in ones or nothing else. Because it it really is like a long on TV. Golf is really long. I saw I the like I saw the clip of the hole in one yesterday, and they they cut it right before the fucking ball dropped. Why? I, I don't know. It, they couldn't it, believe it. it. It's beyond me. What's that about? That, that that they don't they don't understand that like you want to see the fucking yeah. The Tiger was doing hole in one. He's uh no. he's, he's in the hunt. <laughs> He's four off the 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 leader. He's he two blondes in. Huh? Oh, I didn't hear you. He's two blondes in. This new <laughs> chick, I don't know if she can. Augusta, what's her name? Uh, she's the skier. Broad. Yeah. Vaughn. Oh, right? uh, Lindsey Vaughn, I think. Lindsey she, Vaughn. I think I met her once and she had juicy fucking skier legs. Oh, that's her right there. <laughs> that's her right there. There you go, he Dave. Should... You asked there. She was on the tight for you. Cute floppy hat. Whenever he's done with this country, Tiger, he should definitely move to Norway or just someplace like, you know, where there's just a million chicks like that. And where that goes. kind of shit's acceptable. Yeah, you know, <laughs> their kind and our kind. He really has a type, huh? Mm -hmm. And it blondes. ain't one of the sisters. Wow. Mm -mm. He likes them statuesque fucking Well, they're both athletes. Blondes. I mean, come on. Yeah, athlete. Yeah. What does she do? She's a know. skier. Oh. Skier. What did the other one do? I don't know. They, uh, the other one... Uh, she was a nanny. She was a model or something. Exactly. She apparently didn't suck fucking Tiger's cock deep enough. Wow. And she got someone her, said it. Got her comeuppance. Yeah. <laughs> Good. What do you think that fucking Perkins waitress is doing? Oh. I think she's like sitting there going, fuck, man, why, why not me? Yeah. 
Why ain't I? Why ain't I? There? Why ain't I fucking getting it? Yeah. I ate his ass in the parking lot with my fucking apron on. <laughs> I ate his ass with a fish stick in my pocket. <laughs> I see him on the green putting, and behind him is some fucking woman with a beehive with a pencil in it. Yeah, flow. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, telling the paparazzi to kiss her grits. <laughs> <laughs> Can't understand you, why you didn't pick her. Yeah. yeah. I said it, an officer and a gentleman moment is what, uh, yeah. <laughs> what, yeah. what she was waiting for. Yep. Uh, Tiger yeah. Woods walks into the Perkins. Puts that fucking <laughs> takes her away. golf visor on Get her head. Get the fuck out of here. You One, go, girl. One too many times she put a fucking sticky finger. It was sticky with like fucking like blueberry jam. Yeah, honey buns. Buns. Yeah. One with too many syrup fingers. Honey syrup. Honey buns in the morning. <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah. She caressed his face. Her finger would smell like dirty diner waitress. <laughs> <laughs> a fucking a Perkins slop slinger. You want to fucking wash your hands before you touch my billionaire face? <laughs> Slop slinger. A fucking ass eater in the parking lot. <laughs> uh, you know. <laughs> oh, really? That gamey ass of hers? Oh, it was awful. Ten hours on her fucking, on her dogs. Yeah, she would always give, and she'd probably wonder, why doesn't Tiger eat my pussy? Oh, <laughs> fuck. Wouldn't. He would just fuck her in the ass. Give me a foot <laughs> massage. So, big I, bunions. I bet he'd sodomize her in the fucking parking lot. <laughs> like, with her fucking, she'd have her face in the driver's seat of his Escalade, and he'd be standing up behind her. She'd have to smell his golf ass sweat. <laughs> he tried to titty fuck her, but she's just full of filth and just <laughs> tears. He couldn't oh, look at sliding off her. Oh shit! His balls kept over. hitting her bridge. <laughs> you know who has the hottest broad at the Masters though? Mm -hmm. Dustin Johnson. Who's that? Yeah. I know I'm stopping. That's what Dustin Johnson. Right? I understand, but he's going to lead somewhere. Oh, he's he's uh, he's going out with Gretzky's daughter. Wow. Oh, I hear she is a she looker, She is huh? ridiculous. Can you find a picture of her yeah, at the Masters? Dustin Johnson, mm. Dustin Johnson he's, uh, he's right up there with the leaders. He's oh, a, wow. He's a, very, he's he's a very good golfer. Gretzky's daughter. And he's oh, now yes. dating Gretzky's wow. daughter. Wow, she's beautiful, huh? Look at that. How old is she? And, wow. And she's a bad girl, man. It must drive me nuts. I'd love to date her. Oh, I wouldn't shit. mind putting the puck in her uh, scoring <laughs> hole. <laughs> Whatever you call it. That's how she's walking around wow. at the Masters, and they're wow. focusing on Tiger Woods. That's cool. That. Her face looks thick. like Eddie Ift. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. Yeah, she she okay, you know Eddie Ift, the comedian? <laughs> yes. She looks like Eddie Ift. <laughs> Look at them tits. Yeah. Oh, yeah Eddie's man. in good shape. Eddie doesn't have tits. Uh, Look at that. Is that a real racket? Uh, probably. No. Well, no, no, it doesn't look real to me. Her mom had some pretty good tits. We'll go with so. some more pictures of her. She's got some half nudes online. I wouldn't mind squatting over her face and icing her. Yeah. You know, she's going to do hockey terms. Oh, icing. Good. You know what's cool about being a model? Like, once you hit, like, the famous dude, then, like, you can, like, go, like, now I'm really just a hot girl. You know, yeah. like, yeah. whatever. I can turn off my modeling career for a minute. Well, I thought that was her pussy. Look at that. Wow. That's not her. That's her. She's showing full. Wow. No, from, she's wearing something, right? This shows you just from that chick earlier. You remember that grizzly bear attack we were watching earlier with that pussy? <laughs> yeah. So this, look at this. Like this, just like, Jim, what, what are your, I mean, really? No, I think those are panties. No, that's no. She has panties on. Oh, she has okay. panties on. Yeah, I tell you, wearing a unitard, like yeah, yeah. she is. I tell you, looking at her though, I wouldn't mind. Uh, I wouldn't mind taking her to the diner. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> wow, he's not bad either. Look at him. Yeah, look at the abs and the long shorts. You know, it's nice to see a professional Jeez. athlete with real legs. You know. <laughs> <laughs> well, look at that picture of her and another girl with that yeah, big, that nice. fucking green and and red bikinis, that big tits mushed together. Hi, actually. we're just girls. T A A. Paulina Gretzky. The complete yeah. package. She's now hanging with something. Dustin Johnson. Yeah. Damn. He's a lucky dude. Ugh. Wouldn't that be fun if you see Tiger Woods use that, you know that little tool to take the ball marks out of the green on her muff? It's called a face cloth. Oh. <laughs> like he bangs muff. her and then pulls it out and starts fluffing her muff back up. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that would be insulting to her. <laughs> Jesus. Her big fucking Perkins waitress muff. <laughs> Or if he was going to fuck her and he had his caddy, like, lining up the <laughs> shot. Yeah, you kneel down in front of her and look, yeah. He's eyeing the taint. Looks like it's fallen off to the left a little bit. <laughs> she never talked, right? 
And we haven't heard or seen her since. From Perkins? Yeah, he probably paid her. Didn't, no. We saw one picture of her, I think, yeah. when it all went down. That probably gave it. her $1.75 and she went away. <laughs> <She's> so happy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You tell Ty Webb I'm gunning for him. Yeah. He's a bucket of grits, cunts. Now hit the bricks. <laughs> but she kept calling. I'm like, did I leave my dupe pad over there? Or my <laughs> tip calculator something? Yeah. <laughs> I think I left my tampons in your glove compartment. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see a crimper? What's that? It gets the crumbs off the. Uh, over the years, waitress. over the years, I've had girls leave things at my house. They just fucking like dignity, yeah. self respect, <laughs> <laughs> everything but good memories. <laughs> wow. <laughs> See, you paused. Your I mistake know. was you paused. You know that. Oh, Jimmy, he's been funny. doing this long enough to know you can't pause ever. Jimmy's especially around funny. Jimmy. Like I have a drawer. I have a drawer at my house of dedicated to everything that panties, panties, that's been left behind. Bras, fucking earrings, rings, fucking all kinds of shit. Uh, that is, you know, been laundered and stuff. Because right. sometimes it's just like... Are they things that let people left? Or are they things you wear when David Ferry comes over for a party? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody has to act like they're more in the homosexual community. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just, it's, just, it's just things that, like, end up outside. Like, sometimes girls uh, feel... Uh, Compelled to just, you know, take their tops off and jump in the pool. And then they get out and get a towel, and they never put their fucking shit back on. So it's just there in the in the yard sure. in the morning. So you, you know, <laughs> In the yard in the morning. Up, it ends up in the fucking the laundry lost and room. Found, yeah. And Ange has to wash it, and then, you know, it ends up in a drawer. But uh, but other ones are like, they, they've been sneaky. They, like, a fucking, it's cliche, but an earring or something like that. Or fucking, like, some shit is just left. Like under a dresser in really? the fucking bedroom and stuff. It's like that's that's some sneaky, repugnant shit right there. The chicks pull. Why? It's you like marking their territory oh. or fucking like trying to trip you up if another girl shows up. Right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. They'll you should, fucking you think they, do that. They, for Christmas, they, you should use those as ornaments. Yeah. Oh, my God. Just hang it all on the fucking tree. Christmas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the regret miss. The, so, fucking, uh, <laughs> the whore tree. And bring an extra uh, pair of earrings. Yeah, yeah, They're yeah. not going to leave their good ones behind. Yeah, they bring the shitty cheap ones and they throw them into your dresser. Right. Oh, and that gives them an yeah. excuse to come back. Yes. I think I left, like, I think Did I left my see? false leg at your house. Did <laughs> <laughs> you see your left leg up to the thigh? <laughs> it's, it smells like an armpit. <laughs> <laughs> Did I leave my favorite catheter over there? <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Wait, wait. Did I leave my colostomy on your sink <laughs> next to your aqua fresh? <laughs> I've been shitting all over the inside of my sweater. I lost my colostomy. <laughs> Who is this? I'm the girl with Crohn's. Remember that? You made me blow you and hang Remember? my body out the window because I didn't smell good. Did I leave my do's and don'ts after an epidermal? <laughs> You remember me? I had to hang out the window off the balcony and suck your pita. Suck your pita. <laughs> you yelled at me. Oh. Laugh it up while you can. Yeah. Uh, Mayor Wiener won't fucking, have any of this. Blowing me while she looks like a boat pumping out the bilge. <laughs> exactly. So you miss, is it, is either that you have Lewis and Clark's flask on your chest. Or I'd like you to get the fuck out right now. Holy shit. Uh, uh, oh, wow. So you think these girls do that on purpose over the years? I think, uh, yeah, I think it's they It's their have. way of like uh, having... A connection? I think they have over the years of, of like left things like that. Yeah. I mean, I can't see. Uh, you know, just shit being left like that. It doesn't make sense. You should have a yard sale. Can you bring this stuff in? Yeah. We'll go through it. <laughs> I'm going to be really sad. <laughs> I had a girl leave diamond earrings with mm. a girlfriend. Really? We broke yeah. up, and her diamond earrings were at my house. And you can yeah. bet they'll be re <laughs> 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 Am I going to do it to give them back to you? Oh, yeah, sure. Hey, make sure you fuck a bunch of new people in these. <laughs> Not happening. <laughs> <laughs> Not happening. Uh, yeah. girls, are, girls are sneaky. Mm. Sneaky little things. Yep. Mm -hmm. I have a few things. I had a fucking piece of lingerie from a woman one time. This is gym teacher. <laughs> 
And did you like stroke it out? <laughs> oh my god, that fucking awful hairdo. Oh, Where, and she's like, uh, "Hey, look, I'm the I'm the webmaster from JoyceDeWitt.com." <laughs> this girl outside the studio. Oh yeah, <laughs> Joyce. <laughs> 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 fucking awful do. What a terrible fucking Hardy Boys haircut. <laughs> <laughs> Eating pussy is one thing, but you have to wear it on your jacket. We get it. You love cunt. <laughs> <laughs> Say something for Caroline. Yeah. <laughs> He's burning himself out. I'm fucking knocking it out here. You're gonna pull a hand in there. <laughs> Relax. Holy fuck, That's Jimmy. Hilarious. <laughs> yeah, there's something about that. Uh, Did you see that movie Valley Girls like recently? Have you seen it? With Deb Deborah Foreman and Nicolas Cage, yes. Yeah, he is the most attractive thing in that movie. <laughs> Nikki Cage. You think that performance cute? I remember having a crush on her. Yeah, she was hot, but now, huh? in retrospect, you know. Let's look at her. Go ahead. Yeah, take a look. Let's take a look at her. It's the other girl in it who's really hot. The uh, the sluttier one. Ah. Oh, yeah. oh wow. Well, what do we got? Okay, here? there's the Deborah. Looks. What's her name? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to look at her. This being, I'm gonna put my Elizabeth Daly. She's I don't know her. <laughs> Let me see yeah, this. She didn't, you know. Ooh, oh, that yeah. makes me want to finger my prick. Let me Where see her. It? Like Melinda's checking in again. She goes, I got a great pair of sunglasses from your girl drawer. <laughs> 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 they, they loot my girl drawer. <laughs> That's fucking funny. Look at that. I, like that. I can't see. Sam's over there acting like he's fucking on his iPod at home. IPod? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, she, was, uh, she was adorable to Deborah, but who is that? I don't oh, like yeah, that. Uh, the one in the middle, right? Which one was Deborah for? No, she's no, not in any of them. That's Pee Wee's fucking chick from Pee Wee's right. Big yeah, Adventure. I like her. They're all eating roofles. <laughs> let, me, let me hear some of the. Uh, let me hear some of the dialogue from Valley Girl because I. I oh, this is fucking my oh favorite. My God. Okay. Oh, oh, I knew. oh my God! Or something. I wasn't gonna That's say her, anything. but I always thought she was Julie from the Love Boat, but she's not. She's the same. She's uh, not. She kind of looks like her. Julie yeah. from the Love Boat. Because that's that same hair, that kind of like hot skates Irish. She, she uh, had her fall from hair. grace. She was she. <laughs> Julie, the cruise director. She ended up being crazy. She, she, she loved her uh, I crazy think her, broad. Uh, blow. Yeah, they, they, they were zooted up. Well, you know, it was the times. Yeah. But that movie's now coming up on 30 years old, right? 83. Oh, Amazing. Holy yeah. shit. Wow. Holy that. shit. Holy dog shit. Wow. Wow. <clears throat> 83. What have we got here? Yeah, fucking yeah. Valley Girl. Oh, sure. Oh, this is fucking hilarious, it's okay? Stand Full it. screen, bitch. Okay, that girl? So awesome. <laughs> Beautiful, Deborah Foreman. Valley girl. Big gums. Oh, right, right. Right. There's someone. Look this at, is the story of a boy in Hollywood who never dreamed the girl he'd want oh, most shit. was down here. Wow. Wow, wow. this is all tough. Hello. Who invited you? Oh, wow. Uh, you mean you have to be invited? Right? Wow. That explains it. I stand corrected. She had uh, she cute, but she had a weird mouth. She's gummy. A yeah. giant gummy mouth. Yeah, she's it's like gummy. a bunny mouth. Yeah, like she's if I like met a her, bunny rabbit. Yeah, and she looks like she almost is wearing a fucking cancer wig. She, <laughs> that was the eighties. <laughs> yeah, hey, burn victim wig. <laughs> <laughs> she really bugs me. The fucking dumb gums. <laughs> what was she? She's probably doing dentist commercials. That's why we haven't seen her. <laughs> She's the fucking most sought after actress for gum disease <laughs> commercials. You were such a fan two minutes ago. I, I can't know. believe what a turnaround. Yeah, but then she rough. smiled. It looks, yeah. like, it looks like when Conan does those things where he puts a fucking superimposes a mouth. Wow, you paused it like at the re look. If you look behind those two white kids, you oh, see yeah. like a uh, uh, colored couple. Yeah, look at that. It's okay. eighty-three. It's absolutely. They would be called a colored couple because back then, yeah. They, yeah, but it looks like these two have their. 80s. It looks like these two have like a black thought bubbles coming out of them. <laughs> <laughs> black inner, twins yeah. growing out of their heads. Mm, that's good. <laughs> wow, look at uh, very young Nicolas Cage here. Let's Maybe watch the was... rest of the trailer. Yeah. Mm. Why are we wearing this dress for you? See, if I had been invited, I would have known this was a costume party. See, the urban's are trying not to outdance the, uh, the, the white kids. The girl from the valley, who never dreamed she'd ever be seen with a boy from over here. Yeah! Because I'm not getting out of this car! All right, but when they attack the car, save the radio. That's a classic line, isn't it? Ah, it's a really lame punk party. Oh, when can I see you again? I'm here with you now. I know. 
Uh, he points. This she has a fucking dumb cabbage patch doll face. <laughs> I can't Jeez. believe I love her. And fucking, I told you, Nick Cage is the hottest one in it. Cabbage patch doll. Because she's got those dimples. I don't like her fucking hairdo either. Short, mm. fat head. Her short, fat. I bet you that was her nickname in high school. Hey, gums. Or hey, short, fat head. <laughs> Valley girl. Because that's what she should have been killed in her body dumped in the fucking. Oh, God. Oh, oh God. fucking. She looks boom. like her mom, bro. Her hair till she's like just retarded. <laughs> she does look like a tart. Like, a dressed up tart. She has a fucking. Her hair is like that stupid kitty carry all doll that's fucking yeah, silly yeah. lugged around. I hate her hair. Kitty carry all. Well, as they yep. would say, that's a hair don't. <laughs> Remember that? Oh, yeah. So woot. All right, let's. But that uh, was the style back then. Yeah. That's some more. Butch. Fucking doughy faced idiot she is. Loving this. This is the story of Randy and Julie. Mm. The way they come together. See that girl's hot. That's yeah, who's that one again? Herman, Pee-wee's fucking big adventure oh, girl. Guys, have parties over there. Oh, oh, it's like, oh we mean? missed the camel toe shot. Geek that she's Go back to the camel toe. I there want to see Valley toe. I think that guy does uh, stand up now. Oh, what the guy? Right yeah, the, uh, the evil mm. blonde guy. No, it's that fucking. Who's that guy? Uh, Every '80s movie had an evil blonde guy. Yeah. You're right. Uh, the Karate Kid guy. And, yeah. you know. Holy shit, look at the panties on her. Yeah, that's, a, that's giant a bit drawers. of a camel toe there. A little bit, yeah, and those big sure fucking hip-hugging panties. Mm. Dottie, Dottie from fucking Pee-wee's movie was pretty fucking... I think she's, yeah, she, was she was pretty right. cute. Full package there. Mm. Yeah, I bet she was a goer. Right? <laughs> where? Oh, where? At the zoo? This is unapproachable. This could scar her for life. Wow. I'm going to be the mad boy she... God. Life? If you think she's confused, oh, you should boy. see her oh. father. I'm together now. Who's that guy again? Oh, right there. Oh, shit. He's in the Clint Eastwood movies, right? Isn't he that guy from Clint Eastwood movies or no? I don't no. think so. He was in a Sunny. No, he's not Sunny. He Bono. looks like Sunny Bono. Sunny Bono, Bono yeah. Yes. No, no. I, uh, that guy. Fuck. Oh. I know who that is. Oh, he was, he was in the Sunny Bono movie. He played a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that fucking guy? I'm trying to think is of. It? Oh, you know who that is? Oh. Yeah, for stopping queers. <laughs> Remember that? Your subconscious? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> From uh, Falling Down. The guy oh, that was in the. Oh, shit. Remember. Yes. He's in the fucking uh, Army Navy store. Yes. He was he in Apocalypse Now, too, that, this that, guy. Good call. Yeah, he was in Apocalypse that Now. That he played Chef. Yeah. That, Am I right? Is that that's, that's the guy from uh, Falling Down. Is it the down. same guy? Yeah, okay. And wow, his wife chef. in this yep. also is in Apocalypse Now. Oh, man. Is it Chef? That yeah, because he's smoking yeah. pot going, I'm a saucier. Saucier. Before he goes over. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this, they still hold up. <laughs> the fuck are these people? She's the remote. Oh, her dumb face. Randy's hot. She's from the valley. <laughs> He's not. He's not. No, he's yeah. Not. Back then, when a man just punched another man in the face. What an awful trailer. Yeah. She has a oh, fat bitches. doll face. He's, he's a cobra. Oh, faces. <laughs> uh, is that the big joke? This is a big movie. Love with you. The Clash, Bananarama, Modern English, Psychedelic Furs. Furs. Yes. That's good. They give away the ending of the movie. The, the Blasters. Kissing. Yeah. yeah. Some... The guy from the wrong side of the tracks. Mm. <laughs> you know what I fucking hate hearing in a, in a goddamn theater after a trailer? I, I, okay, I, I, I knew it was like I knew what you were gonna say. I don't know, but whatever. What, I, well, I just know whatever you hear after. Uh, what do you hate hearing? Something that would signify happiness <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> or community feelings. <laughs> When a trailer ends and, and and you hear like the little mumbling and you hear like oh, that looks good, yeah, it, that annoys the piss out of me. Yeah, because it never looks. Shut good. up! It doesn't. It never does. But that movie was the most unbelievable. For not one Mexican, not one, no, like anywhere, like yeah. not even like what's going on. Yeah. Not even like the over the top oh, yeah. Mexican. Over the top fucking. Nothing was just like white people on white yeah. people. Yeah, no. unbelievable. That's you know, not like, California, even in the eighties. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe yeah. the eighteen eighties. Ooh, doggy. <laughs> yeah, that girl did have a dumb face. Yeah, yeah I can't believe good, though. You were really okay. into her? I thought she was the fucking bee's knees. Whoa. I had no idea that she fucking had those giant gums and a short, fat doll face. <laughs> That's like when I like Buddy from Family. You remember like Buddy from Buddy Fa from oh, Family? Oh. Fucking Christy McNichol? Yeah, like before she, whatever happened. I mean, she was, there was something hot about her because she was the approachable one. Yeah, the other yeah. One, even, <laughs> even that show became a hornet's nest of just 
same gender issue, whatever, whatever's going on there. <laughs> they built that on a gay Indian burial ground, that house. It really turned into a... <laughs> I think everybody in that show turned whatever. Get the cast of family up there, yeah. sir. Uh, yeah, body. yeah. And then uh, who's the Christy daughter? McNichol did end up being uh, uh, a so. lesbo because uh, Rich, Richard, wow. Richard, my my buddy Richard, who uh, was uh, ended up being gay um, and dying of the AIDS. Wow. Uh, he used to go and uh, go out on dates with her as a beard. Really? Yeah, that was like his job. To make her look How like she was that? fucking, you know, not a, a lesbo. Huh. Yeah. Kim Richards. Yeah, Kim Richards. Kim Richards used to be hot when, um, yeah. for 10 minutes in the 80s. Oh, uh, no, she's, she's, she's on the Bad Girls Club or something like that, right? She's on the Now she's, bat crazy. Crazy. Now she's bat shit crazy. She's super And hot, looks though. 80 years old. Yeah. I don't care. She's hot. I'd give her a smooch. Uh, mm. I'd give I liked her, her in Nanny and the Professor. Oh, God, was she hot in that? <laughs> Okay. Another unbelievable situation. Exactly. Right. You know who she's related to? Uh, who? Paris Hilton. No. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah she's yeah. like her aunt. Same right? kind of fucking... Kim Richards is Paris Hilton's aunt, yes. Wow, it's a lot of smart. There was an 80s movie she did <laughs> where she had, like, crimped hair, and, and she, she looked pretty hot, good in that. Yeah. And she was like in like zero. What she was in the high school, like the apocalypse high school thing one time. Yeah, that? What, what? one time over there. Yeah, whatever. She was like some play some goth chick. I don't know. What the fuck? She is hot. What? <laughs> yeah. Where's what? I like when they show them like hotted up, and then that that really kind of pedophile picture of them when they were yeah. little. Mm. Yeah. And there she is, all eighties out. Yeah. A little mixed message. She's a lovely yeah. girl. She went to I shit really, her really quick. Oh, quite the dish. Oh, quite wow. the dish. Really quickly. She That's what she looks like shit. now. I you know who is hot. fucking hot as fuck now? Huh. That dumb little ch girl that was in the ring. You know the one oh, that yeah, comes yeah, out yeah. of the fucking oh, well. I, oh, I saw you tweet the. Uh, I saw you tweet on. Wow. She's fucking cute That's as the fuck. same girl, huh? Yes. I wouldn't mind smooching with her. That girl got really hot. I like her evil looking. Yeah. 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 I want to fuck her in the movie. I would want her to do that. Yeah, I don't want her to well, eat her ass, to, throw her back in. I don't want her to blow me and just put her hair over her head so it looks all evil. I always want her to do that. Sucks, so it's cool. So I don't have to see their dumb face and their <laughs> loving look while I fantasize they're anyone but who they really are. <laughs> Could you put your hair over your face, please, so I don't have to acknowledge you? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Because it is sucking your cock. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's so odd. <laughs> oh, I know fucking Pekasaka. All uh, right, Chippa. <laughs> yeah, she she ended up really uh really hot. There's a few girls wow. that like the the it's uh, you know who the didn't... broad from Blossom is really fucking hot. Oof, oof, wow. She was on Look the big her, man. Yeah. She, oh, that's right. That fucking that's her, girl. huh? Yeah. From the ring. I take her out. Very God. pretty. Yeah. A movie or something. She looks like yeah. somebody we know. You know who didn't who end up like? uh huh? Oh. Dakota Fanning. I thought she was going to kind of, she kind of looks weird. Her body's a little weird, a little dumpy. She, I mean, she's not. She just got too old for you. No, yeah. I was waiting for her. She's not. Oh, yeah. Was she, right. in that, she just looks a little dumpy. Was she and, in that movie Teeth? Is she that chick? Uh, I don't the, no. Oh. She's all right. She's, she's okay. She's nah, all right. That's really gussied up. Yeah, okay. Let's see her in normal. Give yeah. us a plain one. She's all right. I like, she's cute. She's, she's all right. She, yeah. All right. Yeah. Calm down. I give her a smooch. Well, yeah, I'm not saying I wouldn't. I give her a kiss on the old cheek. I, 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 thought, in the garden. I thought she was going to be uh, <laughs> How's it going better back there? <laughs> I thought she was going to be pretty hot. Oh, you know. She looks like a little English uh, trollop. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's true. Oh. Speaking of English trollop, also the one from fucking uh, Harry Potter. Oh, let's see her. Emma Watson. Wow. Emma Watson? No? Uh, You're not into that Emma uh, Watson? She was she's like, right. uh, she's a little boyish. Yeah. She's got a little boyish. I like that. Yeah. yeah. Well, look yeah, at that hair. The Whoa. fucking dyke hair one. Wow. Sam, That's cool. get a fucking picture of her body That's and great. everything, you she's fucking like freak. fucking William H. Macy in that picture. How about another fucking. Oh, she's, she's got that one. She's got a little head, though. Yeah. Her head like is that. tiny. Models, yeah. models have little heads. Sure they do. It's weird. They have tiny little heads. Exactly. Dumb little fucking brontosaurus yes. heads. <laughs> Their heads are made for not shoving much food in. You yeah. two thoughts in there. Yeah. Oh, that's her in a uh, bikini. No. It's, it's um, probably uh, photoshopped. <laughs> yeah. Photoshop. Mm. She is very photoshopped online. Yeah, you know. yeah, yeah she's, she's all right. There. I don't yeah. know. It's just something about her. She's Girl okay. next door-ish. Yeah, I'd fool yeah. around with her. Yeah, yeah. She looks like she's from, like, British Columbia or some other place. 
No, she's, she's, very... she, that's, that's not bad at all. She's English, is that it? Yeah, she's no, well, fucking you know. limey. So then she's amazingly hot. What about the bikini shot? Pool. Over, 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 over. Thank you. There you go. What is that, a dick? No. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> I almost fell in love with it. There's a strap on it. <laughs> uh, what is oh, that? Yeah. That's, that's unfortunate. A bad, fucking, that's a bad yeah, shot. Like a gooey duck cock. It's a, a terrible duck. one. A dog penis. It does look weird. Something's uh, in mm. the picture, but yeah, that's that's all right. You can fucking... Oh, that's unfortunate. That was behind her body. It's a lawn chair. You could thing. go down on that. Wow. I love that chick. Uh, she, these English mm. women, they just pop up all over. The, uh, the Game oh. of Thrones girl not the super khaleesi one but no the, the other one that was queen? also on the uh well the queen one is 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 pretty hot but the the new one she was also the on the that's tutors. learning to sword fight <laughs> no, yeah. that little urchin yeah i like her no the uh she was on the tutor she's really hot she's dark hair oh. she's another anglo anglo yeah yeah some of them fucking i think it's a left turn they should put the girl from precious in there just as like a weird left right turn. Yeah. right yes get her you know get her working you know what what a country has girls that are not really hot but kind of almost hot australia <laughs> every picture you see of an australian girl there's something a little fucking off they're like yeah, inbreeding uh, and then there's just something a that's inbreeding. A little off. There's some pretty girls in Australia, though. Well, but he's going with the 20 he's hottest, hottest Australian, Australian girls. girls. Would you fucking go with one? You They're... said every. Go with Australian chick, right, regular look, Australian, average I'm Australian. I'm just looking girl. for Australian girls. Yeah. Just put Australian girl without the fucking, like, you know. Without turn, the fucking. Without turn off the, the hot filter. the 20 hottest. Exactly, <laughs> Sam. <laughs> Stop going for the cream of the crop. No, there are. I'm talking regular You're Australian. Looking at nothing but girls. really hot fucking yeah. girls right now. Yeah. So far, your off. argument's you falling You said about the regular girl. Yes. The regular, like, down, regular walking down the girls. street. Regular girls. The regular girl. They're, they look like that. They're very yeah. average. That's yeah. Right. That's kind what's of. mean. She's cute. <laughs> she's cute. She's not average. She's yeah, nice. she's all right. Yeah, but, you know, they. There you go. That's much better right there. They're a little. Exactly, a fucking frump. Stupid fucking. She probably works in a zoo. Too she many moon for... pies and yeah. <laughs> yeah, too many shrimp on the Barbie. <laughs> too, many, too many gigantic beers. Uh, I just noticed. Yeah. Uh, that she rescues time. kangaroo abortions. <laughs> 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 like when a kangaroo is kicked in the stomach by another kangaroo. <laughs> yeah, look, see, there's just she's cute. Something there, She's but fine. Yeah. something's just a she little. Like her, That's what you're saying. She looks like her name is Louise with her dumb Louise. fucking cheekbones. Hello, I'm Louise. <laughs> <laughs> Want a go out? Yeah. Looks like I'm holding little things in my cheeks. We'll go out. Give mm. a couple of beers. Maybe go out on a boat. Yeah, but I bet you their chick is like hotter, just like all the way across. Yeah. Compared to the, I don't know. East Timorians. Well, yeah, you know? East Timorians are known to be uh, <laughs> ugly, ugly people. Peoples. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know who are really hot? These Ethiopian Jews. Have you seen any oh, pictures of them? Oh, stunning. Cheekbones. <laughs> Cheekbones wow. to yeah. here. Cheekbones it must be their false god. <laughs> yeah. I have to tell you. They believe in the bagel, you know, Jesus. Knee, and... Kneecaps like a newborn foal. Lord, them with some beautiful... <laughs> yeah, they do look... <laughs> I district love a good, nine, you know, I like, love a, yeah, like district district nine. kind of kind of buggy. <laughs> <laughs> kind of open a can of cat food, they'll come crawl out. <laughs> but they're very good. They join the army. They do their time. <laughs> kind of buggy. <laughs> they're a little Jesus Christ. Otherworldly. Oh my god. Yeah, well, I guess Australia's all right. Maybe I'm just talking on my yeah, fucking ass over here. I think hard. I don't guys, know I gotta go. You guys Where are you going, Jimmy? I have an appointment at ten thirty. An apartment? Yeah. So that's is all it, uh, Fuck it. Is it something um we should worry about? Oh, no, 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 no. It's about doing a little something. Start with an A, ends with a Z. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Caroline's tonight, Caroline's late show maybe and then Sunday yes I'll be there a Sunday to see uh, our own Jimmy Norton and McGooby's next week in Baltimore nice Ooh. in Baltimore yeah. I'm taking the there wire tour oh uh, that's not a wire tour no I'm just kidding oh, oh. Yeah, well, <laughs> yeah but that'd be cool that would be great that is a good idea that'd be awesome Baltimore. Yeah. David Tell Stress Factory yes mm. ready to go tonight and tomorrow with the one and only Chips Cooney what's that you know, Chips. Good old that, Chips Cooney. Yeah. What's that? <laughs> From America's Got Talent. Yeah. Right? Yep. One of the one of the best regional magicians. If I, if I was a slave owner. <laughs> you like 
Magic with a little comedy. He's your guy. So right. He's doing the opening. It's going to be fun. All right. Thanks for having me in, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you. David uh, Tell, thank time. you, sir. Love David Tell. We also should remind the people that Louis C.K., <laughs> the big yeah. specials tomorrow night. Oh, my God. Debuts tomorrow at 10 on HBO. HBO. Huh? HBO. We have to do more time on Louis C.K.? Yeah, I mean that was five of fi of six. But we did a lot of time on Louis C.K. this week, <laughs> and it was a lot of extra time special. too, huh? Are right, you looking you forward to that? Forward? Yeah, I really am. Yeah, you could do this with me. I think it's going to be great, uh, Louis special. I can't wait to see it. I think it's going to be uh, it's amazing. First of all, to do a special every year like he's been doing is just an incredible amount of of work, and each one is just better than the last one. So I, I it's, I'm a huge fan, and you know I can't wait to see it. I think he uh, starts doing a lot of movies. Who Louis is going to, you think? I think, yeah. I think it's going to be, get tougher and tougher for this guy to stand up. It's going to be great. I think he's moving into the movie business myself. Do you think he's going to be acting in movies or making them himself? Both. He's, he's a very independent Both. guy. He's, he's going to uh, do very, oh. very well. What do you got there, Roland? Wow. Looks like the Louis C.K. Oh, there you go. Wow. wow. So going uh, in. Uh... Looks like I don't have to wait till. 10 o'clock tomorrow night on right. HBO to see Louis C.K. Oh, my God. I'm going to watch oh, this oh, as I drive home that's really through smart. the Queens Midtown Tunnel toll plaza. Very good. Those fuckers uh, are wrong? after me, by the way. Oh, nothing. Uh, have you seen the special? Yeah, it's funny. Well, you got to give us a little more than that. Why um, is it funny? She goes on stage and goes, hey, guys. And tells some jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Stories and little anecdotes. Spoiler alert. Stories. <laughs> Does he get edgy? Anecdotes. Does yeah. he get edgy? Anecdotes. Yeah, he's like, what's the poison? Wait. Like, what's up, you cunts? <laughs> oh. For, for the poison you just drank, Dr. <laughs> Jones. <laughs> <laughs> Anecdote. Then, Antidote? Antidote. 60 minutes later, ta da, it's over. Oh. Well, that's, a, that's an amazing review for Louis yeah, C.K.'s so Oh My God special. I, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I know you poo-pooed it there, but I think it's no, that's, great. That's rolling excited about something, oh, Dave. Okay. You're very good. You're a little jaded. There, <laughs> no, he's, it's the <laughs> antidote to the average Saturday night. There you go. I like that. There you go. Louis C.K., Oh My God, debuts tomorrow night at 10 o'clock on HBO. Let's all watch, people. For sure. Thank you, David Tell. Thank you for See having you soon, me, buddy. Stress Factor this weekend. Let's not forget.